Peace and blessings, Young Nas from I Got Options LLC. And in this video, I wanted to briefly talk about what a stop loss is. So, a stop loss. What is a stop loss? A stop loss, think of a stop loss as your safety measure when you're trading, right? Or when you're investing. You know, what do people do on a stock market? They buy, they buy it and sell, right? In hopes that the price will go up of their stock. So, with that being said, there's risk, right? You know, you're at risk of buying something and then the price of that stock just goes down, you know, and then that causes you to lose money, right? So to protect yourself, there's something called a stop loss, which is basically, you know, in order to sell something to prevent it from to protect your your investment, right? So like if I if I were to buy 500 shares of AMC right before it skyrocketed, right and I'm just holding it I'm not being smart I'm not taking profits you know while it's up and the next day it drops to like it drops 50% of what it was of where I bought it at right so it's it's down tremendous now I don't have I don't have what's called a stop loss so I don't have basically a sell order to take me out of AMC if it goes down too much that's basically what a stop loss is it's a safety measure if you know it's a safety measure so if I had a stop loss, then I could I could prevent myself from being down 50%. I could have my stop loss, you know, set to where, you know, if I'm down 25%, take me out of AMC. That's what a stop loss is. You know, it just takes you out to protect yourself from, you know, this stock going down anymore. That's all a stop loss is, right? So stop losses are important to have when you're trading and investing because you need to protect yourself because nothing, nothing is guaranteed in the stock market. Nothing. I meant that when I said nothing is guaranteed. So you have to protect yourself, you know, so, you know, just manage your risk and, you know, use stop losses.